so let's come back and start doing reasoning questions in your um, ammonia basically very uh, different important uh, and different varieties of reasoning questions are given i'll be doing all those and then we'll go back to nitric acid done so whenever i have to do such questions okay this this is a pa paragraph based question let us read the question carefully and write the, this type of questions also may be given in the exam so here first question explain why ammonia is basic while b bih3 is only feebly basic okay they basically they said ammonia is basic okay done so when i go down the group <coughs> the hydride form of this is feebly basic explain the reason in your board key there will be basically only four important sentences which you should uh, remember and those only should uh, you should be able to write in the exam so when you start explaining about the basicity don't write different different paragraphs which are irrelevant to the answer most important how do you explain its basic nature so this said in h3 nitrogen like uh, phosphorus okay uh, your uh, what do you say uh, uh, antimony bismuth right right now they said they have compared this one and this one right hmm. now they said this particular thing is basic and this is feebly basic they said well, let's prove so for something to prove its basicity first important keyword which you have say down the group what will increase yes atomic size increases yes down the group done when the atomic size increases what will happen to the electrons which are present on about nitrogen has a lone pair in that way what will happen to the electron density on bismuth right electron density decreases down the group i'm talking about down the group down the group when electron density because the size is increasing the electron cloud is spread all over isn't it so when the electron density uh, decreases donation of electrons or uh, the do the property of uh, donating electrons it decreases isn't it because it is all over here it's fine concentrated and it can donate but here donation of electrons becomes donation of electrons also decreases when the donation of electron decreases we very well know lewis basic nature according to lewis the basic nature basic nature reduces when the basic nature reduces what you can easily see hence bih3 is feebly basic compared to nh3 simple size increases disperse, dispersion of electron cloud when the dispersion of electron cloud is more that means the spreading of the electron cloud is more donation of electrons also becomes uh, difficult when it is not donating becomes feebly basic now let's see now in this particular thing so try to mention one two three four terms those are the keywords and so uh, they've given me one paragraph based question let me read the hydride of group 15 element dissolved in water okay hydride of group 15 that means i have to form <coughs> take a group 15 element and the hydride form of this hydride of group 15 dissolved in water to form a basic solution okay basic solution done this solution dissolves as agcl precipitate name the hydride what is the chemical equation okay let me take one hydride of group 15 that means nh3 hydride of group 15 that is nitrogen is group 15 now this is dissolved in water now what did i say they form in water to form a basic solution so ammonia when dissolved in water one hydrogen from here picks up this hydrogen nh4 the leftover is this now you have got a basic solution according to this question write that basic solution now this basic solution dissolves silver chloride precipitate now silver chloride when it is dissolved in water right what does it form it's going to form a complex we have already seen this so first initially what will this happen to this will break up into nh4 plus plus oh minus isn't it yes <clears throat> so that's base uh, same thing now i picked up this ion and together it's going to form a complex we have already seen in the earlier equation silver metal atom this being a ligand it's going to form right nh3 right so and the leftover chlorine occupies this complex so this this is a complex ion <coughs> this is white a ppt and this is your colorless this is twice isn't it okay according to the this invalid see colorless so now 
you can also take the name the hydride okay hydride have named write the chemical equation now you can also write this reaction in this way just see <laughs> here if you are getting confused from where did i get this ammonia same thing you can take the cl hydride directly you can pick up because they want to uh, show the formation of complex a and so the hydride i am writing the hydride take the two moles of hydride you take take silver again now form the ligand in the brackets how many two and the leftover chloride so this is again a complex ion which is colorless